Kevin Trapp here coming to you from East Nashville, Tennessee. Hey, I'll get right to it. Uh, man, it's a beautiful day here in Nashville today. It's Monday, uh, down to 82 or 83 degrees, low humidity, and just beautiful, man. We've had a hell of a storm the other day. Garth Brooks got completely rained out. It, it, the wind blew and the shit flew. And, uh, man, it was crazy. Lightning, thunder, the whole nine yards. Um, the thunder rolled, baby, and Garth Brooks was out of here. Uh, felt bad for him, man. But anyway, so uh, some beautiful weather. I'm going to try to go hit the pool, get a little exercise today. Uh, but I wanted to do a video. Uh, what I did just there, like I said, no extra charge for mistakes. But what I wanted to show you, and, and of course, I'm going to try to, you know, use this to promote what I'm doing to ma help make a living and, and all this stuff. So a um, lot of stuff going on, man. I'm talking about um, doing uh, a couple new recording projects coming soon possibly an electric and an acoustic uh, record together. I'm redoing my website. I'm redoing my branding, my whole thing. New merch coming, new photos, um, the, the whole nine yards, folks. I'm, I'm, it's time, you know, over the past four or five years, every four or five years, it's time to ramp stuff back up and rebrand re and re, re kind of refresh and all that kind of stuff. And so anyway, with that being said, let's, re, let's refresh our playing here and look at stuff in a different way. So what I was doing there was, this is really important to, to take these five shapes and just focus on the one, four, five, being able to play around the one, four, five, which would be A, D, and E in each shape, the A shape, the G shape, the E shape, the D shape, the C shape, and back up to square one. This is what we call the cage system, and I didn't know it was called that, but when I was a kid, I learned these fundamentals and it completely changed my life. The chord being the foundation. The arpeggio being the first level of framework, the pentatonic being the second level, level of framework, the major scale being the third level of framework. So if you learn these chord shapes and you learn the information around those, this is all going to start taking shape. I promise you, learning chords is a direct link to learning how to shred or play lead guitar or fills or great rhythm or anything we want to be able to do on this instrument. We have to be able to visualize the chords and those key constellation notes, those key chord tones. This is how we play melodically. This is how we play the blues. This is how we play jazz, country, rock and roll, funk, anything you can imagine. This is how we do it. And I know this because I've talked to a lot of incredible musicians and worked with a lot of incredible musicians. And I've also talked to um, a lot of great jazz guitar players that are, that are coming from a... <clears throat> very schooled background and they say man you're looking at it the right way this is just how we look at it west montgomery the same thing we're looking at playing over these different chords and chord shapes to get the sounds we want over the music that's going on in the moment and so as i always like to say it's about the spirit of music it's about learning these fundamentals and being able to get past those and actually be able to know what we're doing on the guitar when you sit down and play the guitar let's play with a purpose <clears throat> let's play our let's play a chord and go okay a7. I'm going to stick with A7. I'm going to really get into that sound. I'm really going to get into that sound. Outlining that. E7. Back to A7. Learning how to really navigate through the sounds we want to get with freedom and not thinking about it. If you have to think about it, you're already going to be too late if you're on the bandstand playing music uh, that's up to time. And so when we when we sit down, let's let's have fun on the guitar, let's noodle around and get warmed up, but then let's let's try to practice or play with some purpose and really try to make something musical. Uh, you know, play play out a C major for five or ten minutes, but really stick to it. Then maybe play to some backing tracks and play. Make sure you're playing and holding yourself accountable to some time. It's all about uh, you know timing, melody, groove. Um, yeah, phrasing. These are the things we need to keep reminding ourselves of. Um, and, and man, I'm so excited. You can tell I'm fired up. I haven't had any alcohol. I think it's day 47 today. No booze. 
And so, man, I'm feeling great. I'm down to 159.1. I had some ribs. I had some macaroni and cheese. I had some ice cream last night. You can do this, friends. We can do this together, man. Let's let's feel good together and rock on. Um, I'm I'm feeling so good. I've I've obviously I've had some coffee this morning as well, and so uh, I'm 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 energized. I'm feeling great. I'm gonna go to the pool and and take some some laps and get some sun, and. Uh, you know, it's just a fun life, man. The adventure continues. We had Dennis Quaid come out the other day, uh, Friday night, and, and sit in with us, making friends with him. Um, been hanging with John Oates, getting got back, getting some dates on the books with him in December out in Colorado and L.A. and Aspen and stuff like that. Um, uh, to talk to Billy Gibbons again on the phone. I'm not trying to drop drop, drop names. I'm just excited that uh, that all this stuff's working out, man. It's been it's been 20 years and, and it's, there's been some amazing token moments, but this town just continues to be on fire and so motivating and so um, inspiring. So not to get on a long tangent about that. Thank you guys so much for the positivity. Please check out the links below. Uh, if you want to help me in any way as far as, um, you know, uh, helping to get some of this content together, you, uh, with, you know, it's going to cost a lot to get all this stuff going with the live uh, trio content, two new records, website redesign, all this stuff that I'm doing. It's just a big, big, big push right now I'm doing. If you want to help out with that in any way, you can check out the tip jug below. Venmo is Guthrie, uh, at Guthrie-Trap. PayPal is pick at GuthrieTrap.com. Um, also, um, Definitely check out, if you want to expand on any of these concepts and really, really get into the engine room of how I'm thinking about music and the guitar, I'd love to spend an hour with you on a private masterclass lesson on Zoom or Skype. Those are great. You can record the whole thing. Or the really great one is the over 200 lessons that we filmed uh, at the beautiful studio out at Artist Works. Great company there. Taught by professionals, not professors. These are working musicians. I'm not a music teacher. I'm a professional guitar player first and foremost, and I enjoy teaching and sharing some of this knowledge that I've been able to gain in my 20, uh, well, actually like 35 years of playing guitar now at this point. And so let me help you uh, shed some light on things and, and help you not waste your time uh, practicing the wrong stuff and, and that kind of thing. So check out Artist Works. All the links are below. Uh, please check out Instagram. I'm almost up to 34. Three or four, 34,000 followers on there. This all helps, folks. It helps me stay motivated and helps me want to keep sharing this stuff with you guys. So really appreciate you. Uh, thanks a million for all the positive comments. And uh, man, let's just, let's rock on. I'm, I'm feeling good and, and, uh, and, and you can too. Let's do it together. All right, see you guys. Talk to you soon. Bye.